Hi everybody, welcome to Andy's Beer Reviews. This is what we're looking at today. This is from Pilot, it's their double mochaccino. An Imperial Stout coming in at 9.5% ABV. Pilot, a uh, brewer based in Leith in Scotland, so just north of Edinburgh. I think actually in Leith, actually in Edinburgh, but it's not the city centre. Um, yeah, there are, let me, before I pour it, a little warning to myself and to everybody watching that this is about four months out of date, this bit, not out of date. It's four months past its best, so there may be a little bit of an eruption. But I'll be looking forward to trying this, so let's get it out of the can. Ah, you see, perfect. Perfect, perfect. Excellent, excellent. So it is past its best. So I apologise to Pilot if I don't like it. But it's Imperial Stout, what's not to like about an Imperial Stout? And I can't talk and pour. There's a few of us that review beers that can't talk and pour. And I'm just one of them. Um, I think I paid... Um, I can't remember where I got this from, and I really can't remember how much I paid, but the, you can pick these up for about uh, £3, £3.20, something like that. They do um, a couple of different versions. They have uh, a lower ABV one, which is just the uh, Mochaccino Stout, and they also do a barrel age version, which I can't remember the ABV of that one either. Um, I have had the barrel age version of it um, before. Uh, and I do remember it being very, very tasty indeed. So that has poured jet black. I've not seen any light come from there at all. And it's got a good, as you can see, a good tan head. Nice, um, looks like a nice creamy smooth head. It looks great. Let's get those aromas, shall we? Oh, that smells really dark. It is a really dark, obviously, but it smells like it as well. It smells like, I'm being honest, the only thing getting out of there is a really dark espresso. That's all I'm getting out of it. But it smells good. Right, taste test. Cheers, everybody. Well, that's nice that is nice um, and it's a treat I'm recording this actually um, on Thursday and I normally have uh, I normally don't drink I try not to drink uh, during the week um, and what I like to do is over the weekend record where the light passes I'm not far from the front of the garden so uh, you're doing a lot of traffic here um, yeah, I try to record all my reviews at the beginning of uh, the, the weekend and then release them each day. And I've just, ran, I didn't have a lot to drink this weekend, so I ran out, I've run out of, um, run out of reviews. So I've had to come into the uh, ale house and record one on the day it's release. So this is a nice and, and uh, pleasant for me, and it's a nice, pleasant drink as well. Um, like the aroma, it tastes really dark. You can taste the darkness in this one. But it's nice. It's. Um, you name it, if it's dark, it's probably in there uh, without the lumps of coal. Um, there's treacle in there, there's dark sugar in there. You got the really dark espresso in there. Picking up a little bit of dark chocolate as well in there. Um, 
little hint of vanilla but it's mainly those dark strong dark flavors um yes it is dark yes it is malty but there's just a really nice touch of delicate sweetness throughout it as well which is balancing it out quite a lot it's really balancing it out quite nicely and I have to say for a nine and a half percent beer it tastes boozy but it doesn't taste nine and a half percent it's, it's a lot of it is I think what it is, I think a lot of those, there's some good, strong, dark malts in there and I think that's masking some of that, that taste of the alcohol. So it doesn't feel like it's it's stripping the mouth. I, mean, I am getting that little bit of, um, like it's tasting, it's tasting boozy, just get a little bit of warmth down my throat. Not a lot, just a little bit of warmth down my throat. Um, but that is a really good imperial stout. Um, dark malts, it's dry and you just got that lovely sweetness and like I say everything that you can think of that's, that's dark you can throw in a beer, uh, you know, your treacle, your espresso, your chocolate, your kind of your dark sugars are, are in there and it's working really 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 well. I like that a lot. I like that. I'm going to score that. I'm going to score that eight and a half out of ten. It's a very, very nice imperial stout. Um, no, I've underscored it. I've underscored it. It's a nine out of ten. That is a nine out of ten. Shocker! I've changed my score. I had to have that extra extra half point it is a nine out of ten from andy's beer reviews there's nothing else about it whatever you're drinking tonight please enjoy it until the next review cheers everybody